What is up everyone, JPR Tech here and today I got an unboxing and review of a really cheap affordable ball head tripod. Now my former tripod was this Velvon video tripod that was really uh, rugged and hard but it was very heavy unfortunately recently it broke so i need a replacement very quick now this is a disclaimer alert this is for people on extreme budgets now this tripod is even cheaper than those chinese knockoff of the manfrotto tripods so please keep your standards realistic now the tripod I ended up getting in Amazon is the Chi Heisen. It cost me $35 including shipping, so this is dirt cheap. So let's open up this puppy and see what we get inside. And also, I'm gonna give it a try and give you my thoughts on it. So right away, the tripod, it is inside a carrying bag, which is included. And also inside there is a quick shoe mount, smartphone mount, and a cleaning cloth. Now this tripod is com compatible with mirrorless cameras, compact cameras, and smartphones. And the metal construction is aluminum, so it's very lightweight, but it's still sturdy. Now the recommendation weight is three kilos, which is more than enough for like full frame metal cameras like the one being carried right now. Now the total length of it close is 28 centimeters, which is pretty compact and it gets as high as 135 centimeter, which is about chest height. Now the minimum and the minimum mounting height is 29 centimeter, which is pretty much on the floor. The tripod head, it is a ball head, so you have various uh, positions that you can adjust, even the vertical one for portrait. Now, the overall weight of everything is less than 800 grams, so it is super light. Overall, I feel like this is a great bang for your buck. The ball head is really smooth. It's compatible with other quick shoes, which I did put one in the smartphone mount, another one on my prime zoom lens, so it's always there and ready to set up. The mount head is removable as well. If you need to, you can upgrade it or replace it. The metal screws also give you a nice sense of well-built, as well as the legs are very easy to prep. Just twist and pull and lock, and you're ready to go. Also, there is one grip on one of the legs, which is a nice addition. And on the center shaft at the end, there's an end hook to add weight for stability. And if you flip that upside down, you could get close to, to do some macro photography. So overall, it's really light and compact and can even fit on my regular backpack. Now, as far as the cons, yes, the shaft lock is plastic. And also the maximum height is not as good. And also the ball head, it actually doesn't lock all the way. It's stiff, but it does move with applied pressure. With that said, I was able to get shots of the moon this past week with the super blue blood moon, as you seen on my last video. So it is passable. Just keep the tripod low for more stability. So if you keep your standards realistic, you'll be more than happy with what you get in this tripod package. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and smash that like button, subscribe for more future reviews and tutorials, and I'll be seeing you guys on the next one. Peace.